This is me on the uh, last mission of a legend chaos waste, just so you guys are tracking. Uh, I wasn't recording the rest of it, just didn't really feel like it, but since I made it this far, I figured I might as well show the crowning achievement of a potential win, but it's also equally a potential fail, because we share damage, and that's how I died last time. Same exact place. Let's do this. Yeah, dude, I couldn't be bothered with, by that guy. Tax to full gun, so many to duel. Yeah, I got a lot of perks, but the main thing is I got extra stamp shields. My block cuss is reduced by 60%, and I'm always counted as blocking, and I always parry when I block. So, I have extra damaging items too, but not nearly as much as I just, my guy's built to be unkillable. And this thing is plenty with its power. I think we're good then, is what that means. Claim the sacred scroll. Alright, well, let's check out the, uh, the stats. Let's see who outperformed who. Obviously, this is not a team game. It's all about that green circles at the end. I think probably Carillion or the Flamer took me for a ride. Probably beat me both times. I did do pretty good, I feel, with that Bretonian Sword. That thing is actually better, in my opinion, than the other one by far. This cleave damage is way better. Cleave potential. I can cut through more people. Let's do this. 
Got three curses, purified four chests. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. You're not gonna make it out. Yeah. That's what I thought. Didn't even need Renault's gift. Most melee kills, damage dealt, and damage to monsters. I am, dude, if that is all I ever get. I mean, I still had 375 headshots, the most second highest, right? And my damage taken was the second lowest, actually. So this Bretonian sword is a lot nicer. When I was using the Mason sword, I was getting way too into range of people and taking damage that way. <laughs> Only had four range kills. I did not kill the most elites, though. But I had a pretty even spread on both, so that's nice. 800 total kills, though.